I got myself a new journal. My last one, this lovely beast is is done. <laughs> also, this is so exciting because I don't remember finishing up, like finishing to the brim. Every single page is done. I don't remember finishing a journal like this in a while. Because most of the time I do either junk journaling where I just pre-decorate everything and then I just write in this and maybe at some point I add some decoration as I go. But with this one, I went from just like blank journal and section by section, page by page, I was decorating as I was needing it. And that's a, that was amazing. I actually think that this may be my favorite journal and my best journal. One of my best journals, that is actually a diary journal and not a specific junk journal. This one may be my best one. As for now, it is my favorite. I got a new one. I already started doing stuff in it. As you can see, a few, I think, because of course it is by section. And two of them are already kind of done. I didn't do a lot, like there's not a lot of decoration. I got two magazines. One of them, I am in the process of cutting out stuff and actually getting it on in here. So two sections are already done. <laughs> I have uh, one more magazine that I will be cutting out today. And this is about the, this is the travel, the National Geographic. And actually those magazines are so full, like to the brim with stuff that's actually very, for me, for my aesthetic stuff, this is like a lot of, first of all, beautiful landscape. But also, I don't know if I will find it, but a lot of backpacking, yeah, backpacking, something like backpacking, hiking, which is very, very me centric, let's say. So I will be for sure using this, and maybe I will add, out, add in some of the Austrian travel journals, travel journals cutouts to this one. I want to use the things that I already have, so the pop-out things from the books, the flowers that I have, the vintage drawing, drawn flowers, I cut out every single one of them so I can finally just get them all in. I'm excited actually. <laughs> I'm excited about starting a new journal. Also, this one is a little bit different from this one. It's the same height, but this one is wider and also this one is like more narrow and this one is more of a square, which is kind of nice. And also, you cannot really see it right now, but this journal that is full is kind of the same size spice, spine, spine-wise as this one which is new so this one is a little bigger i think it has 100 and something pages this one has 86 pages or something like this so this was the black one was a standard one and this one is just huge and i don't know if i will be doing something with the cover i like the cover
I will get like a page full and then the cutouts from the around where the page of course doesn't fit into my journal I will try to fit in my travel journal and also I, I was thinking that I can look around my other shops that have magazines in them if they possibly but like please please have it if they have any magazine issues of the travel travels what is it travel if they have italy and i know i saw an issue about italy somewhere but i don't know if this was a travel austria or was it just some kind of traveling book that I happened to stumble upon at some point because good lord knows that now I want it <laughs> having a whole, not journal, but a whole section in my travel journal about Italy including the text from the traveler because the text is also kind of nice and the, again, the pictures still like that would be so nice and also making it also would be so nice because I got to look at the pretty picture and I got to cut out the pretty pictures and glue in the pretty pictures and then decorate the pages with the pretty pictures. I just thought that this journal is so huge it will probably last me for the fall as well. Which is kind of a scary thing because I wanted a separate journal for the fall but now that I'm looking at it it's huge so maybe this is the second and the last one of my summer journals I'm going to very quickly check if the magazine place that I usually go to has the Italian issue that I am kind of daydreaming about. If not, I am praying that I just maybe remembered wrong the Portuguese issue. So maybe this one. They don't have it. trying to find a milk something like milky beverage alternative to milk <laughs> like normal milk even milk without lactose I tried soya I tried coconut and oatmeal oat not oatmeal oats I don't, none of them are <laughs> quite to my taste I wanted to try almond because I never get around with that. Today there was no in stock, so I got the hazelnut and the matcha that I made tastes hazelnut only. <laughs> like nothing else. You cannot I cannot feel 
Like taste the matcha at all.